Good evening, tie-dye family. I have a heart tied in this extra-large tee that is long-sleeved. One of my viewers asked me what I did with the long sleeve. And I wanted to show this part because, as you notice, I took the rest of the shirt after I created the heart and folded it into the natural lines that the heart created. I did put a few in here to keep them smaller. Now I'm going to begin the sleeve. And you do want them lined up nicely and flat so that they can fold well. And then you just fold them in to the pattern just like you would the rest of the clothing or the cloth of anything large. So, what, I have one, two, three, four nice pleats there. So I'm going to make sure I have four nice pleats down here too. Then... Start with one of the baby hair rubber bands by putting it on the end of the sleeve to keep those together while you work from the other end, continuing to band the rest. I will have bands all the way down that sleeve. Thought you might want to see how long sleeves were done. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Now that I have the heart all tied and on my racks, where all I have to do is dye and set it aside to batch, here we go with Fire Red for the heart. Fire Red is a bad bleeder, so notice I'm not putting a whole lot right next to that line. I'm going to leave a little bit of space. I like white right outside my heart. And I'm starting now with gunmetal gray and hot pink. One of the shirts I did last week had rave reviews. And it was a combination of gray and pink. I found it very interesting that that was popular. So... Thought I'd do a bigger one that size, or like it, <laughs> in similar colors, only larger. So, I'm using hot pink gunmetal gray. I sure like that hot pink. I do believe that's going to be a color that I order in a larger quantity because I'm already almost finished with my bottle of hot pink. I've used it so often. I liked it so much. It was one of my new Dharma colors this month. Notice I went under and around the tag. I have begun leaving the tags in. It's easier than trying to read. Um, even if they have a printed label in the neck, it's still easier to read the tag. Especially after dyeing because the tag doesn't take dye. Because it's nylon. I love that. 